We are here at FANEC for the Manufacturing Day field trip. We got a tour of the facility and here's what we saw. It doesn't conform. So quality inspection, make sure that it was, it was manufactured properly. If it's not, it could go to a rework area and get, get that fixed. We got to see the different types of robots they make and how they work. A link. We, we also call it the Enkotsu robot, which is a Japanese word for fist or hand, because it has a similar dexterity to the human hand. Hi, my name is Denise Gant, part of the human resources team. Um, so I'm responsible for many of our early career development programs, our apprenticeships, internships, co-ops. Primarily. Uh, could you elaborate more on the uh, opportunities you have for school students, for apprenticeships and internships? Sure. Um, the apprenticeship program is specifically for robotic technicians. It's a two-year training program. Um, you have to have just a high school education and at least be 18 for that. Um, and then our internship programs are geared towards the four-year degree programs. So you do have to be at least a sophomore. Um, to be eligible for those programs. And uh, lastly, what's your most fun part of the job working at FANEC? Um, good question. Um, I love working with the students. Um, yeah, it's, it's great working with young minds, very open to learning new things. So yeah, I would say that's probably my favorite. All right, thank you. <laughs> We're using a camera to find these EpiPens as though they were coming out of like an injection bolt machine. My name is Joe Baldiga. So I'm the National Education Program Manager. So I work with high schools, community colleges, and universities to integrate uh, automated equipment. So robotics, CNC machines, and that type of technology into schools so students can go out and get good jobs in manufacturing. All right, and can you just briefly explain what Manufacturing Day is? So Manufacturing Day is like my favorite day of the year. So it's an opportunity for students to go to different manufacturers and, and see how it's made. So there used to be a TV show called How It's Made on TV. And basically this is like the, the open tour live version of that. So students can come in, get an opportunity to tour these different facilities and see what it's all, all about. I jokingly let talk about like Charlie and the Chocolate Factory, that movie where like Charlie got the golden ticket and got to go see how the chocolate was made. Well, this is that opportunity for students to see how everything gets made. So cars, uh, from cars to uh, basically everything is manufactured. There's nothing that isn't somehow touched by manufacturing that we interact with in our day-to-day -day life. All right, so uh, what do you think is like the most uh, fun thing to do here? Fun thing to do, um, I, I've been here for 23 years and every day I'm blown away by the technology. So the creativity of people being able to use their brains and, and technology together to solve different problems. That's what I think is awesome. We ended the day by having a quick training session to learn how to move, program, and use these smaller robots. Uh, my name is Julian. Uh, my name is Chris. Brian. And how was your experience for the manufacturing day today? Oh, I thought it was really fun, really cool to see all the different robots and how they work with each other to like form all the products that the companies use. Um, I liked it a lot. It was very insightful and in, like the what Fanuc does as a business and like how much of an impact they have in manufacturing. And what was your most in interesting part about the the company or the things you learned there? I mean, I really like the part where they were lifting out the one-ton uh, battery for electric vehicles. I thought that was pretty cool because it's just such a massive battery that weighs so much and they're just moving around with such ease. Um, I really liked using, like tinkering with the robot when we were taught how to use the robot and like stacking, I stacked like four cylinders which is really cool. Um, I find all like the type of robots they make like so many uh, varieties of robots that they make and there was this really cool one it was like a big one and it was carrying a whole Corvette so I think that was and what would you rate your experience for the manufacturing day trip I'd say a 9 out of 10 it was really fun I think I learned a lot and it was a really enjoyable experience I'd give it a 10 it was really fun uh, I think I'd give it a 9 I really enjoy like the training part where we got to you know do our own robots and we could control it that's it for now. See you next time, Wildcats.